Good morning. <laughs> Tomorrow's moving day and I have a bunch of things that I need to still get done. It's not a lot to do, but I just need to take all of it, put it in the suitcase or in bags or something, and just make sure that everything's ready for tomorrow. So I'm gonna go to the dentist now and get my teeth cleaned. But before that, I'm gonna try and put in my contact lenses. I have glasses and I really don't enjoy it. I don't like something sort of like stuck on my face. I don't know if I'm gonna put them in properly, but I'm going to try. So just me trying. Enjoy the entertainment. Okay, as you can see, I'm teary eyed. But I got them in. I mean, I can't believe that I actually got them in. I thought it would be much harder. Okay, now on to get my teeth cleaned. Okay, I did that. That was painful. You know some people that are they're, they're really good and they're really sensitive and very gentle. This dentist was not gentle. <laughs> but I did it and now I have clean teeth and I'll come back in three months and do it all over again. So now I think what's smart to do is to go and do grocery shopping for my new apartment. It's just really important to stock up now for the weekend. Either way, I gotta get it done. Let's go. I have not done my own grocery shopping for months and months and months. It actually feels pretty good to be doing this. I feel like an adult again. It's so insane on a Thursday or a Friday in the supermarket because everyone is getting ready for Sabbath. I can't even tell you how much I bought right now. It's like burning a hole in my pocket, but I also need to consider the fact that I just bought a lot of things that will last for a long time because I'm just moving into my apartment, so... Check! Did that. Okay, I am back home after going to the supermarket. Now all I have left to do is take the things out of the closet. What else do I need to do? Get some random things, put all of my boxes in the same place. So we're just gonna take it one thing at a time. You wanna help me? Is that what you're trying to say? Okay. This is what we're dealing with, ladies and gentlemen. Your grace will be enough when my eyes can see what you have prepared for me. Your grace will be enough. So I'm not really done packing, but I came up to the balcony to put up my laundry. And then I paused and said, I really love this view and I'm going to miss it so much. This is literally my favorite view in the whole wide world. I know it's simple. It's not the most spectacular view, but I love this view. And I'm thinking every single time I look at it, wow, I've gone through so much good and bad in this desert and in this house and every single time I come back here somehow you know go back to the same room to the same bed and it's weird because at this point I didn't think that I would you know you think that life would look differently you know I would be married by now I would be out of the house by now and life doesn't always look like that I don't know if I'm ever going to live in this house again I'm hoping not I'm hoping that this time when I leave It'll be a journey that I will go towards someone else and make that journey with someone else because, you know, at a certain point, you just want to be independent of your family so that you can make your own family. You don't always get where you want by the time that you wanted it. All that to say, I'm gonna miss this view. I'm going to have a very different view. Once I move, it's not going to be wide open landscapes, but it'll be what I need for the time. You'll see the grace that he giveth and giveth and giveth again. Good morning, everyone. Okay, I didn't sleep a lot, but I guess I'll sleep well tonight. <laughs> it's moving day. I'm gonna shower, do a few more things that I need to get done. Right, Stinky? 
let's start this day. Okay, I only put some things in my car, like groceries. I'm going to help my sister take her things into the van, bring it back to my parents' house, take my stuff, put it in the van, and bring it back to my new apartment. So let's just hope I find parking. <laughs> I'm here, and so is all of my sister's stuff. It's a really hot day. It's gonna be between 27 and 32 today. Oh Me beep. how do you feel that you're going to another house? Are you ready to say goodbye? Of this all of this waiting for me but right now I'm just ready to sleep and eat honestly I think for lunch I'm going to keep it super simple with only like finger food because I don't know where my things are <laughs> so sweet potato fries chicken schnitzel cucumber in a pan because I don't know where my plates are Baby's here! <laughs> Baby is so sweet. She came and brought me food and love and acceptance. Of course! <laughs> and she's also gonna help me clean. And always trust Baby to do something to perfection. baby's gone we actually made quite a lot of progress i really needed the bathroom to be clean because i thought to myself if that isn't clean then i won't feel comfortable with anything baby also insisted on helping me make the bed i am honestly just super grateful to be here grateful for my brother-in-law and will and my sister for helping me and baby also and yeah i think i'm going to call it a day and sleep and See you guys tomorrow. Good night for the meantime. And strength is rising as I wait patiently. Your words, they come.